Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel 100% Pure Elvis. Thank you for taking the time out to return to my channel today and I hope this all sees you well. And if you are new to the 100% Pure Elvis channel, thank you for joining and welcome aboard and I hope you enjoy the channel going forward. What I'm going to share with you today is an LP titled International Hotel Las Vegas, Nevada, Elvis, August 26th. 1969. This 2LP edition was released on the RCA Legacy label in 2019 to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the concert itself. And the LP in question is this one. And as you can see, I've got its original sticker in the top left. I love keeping original stickers. And this image here. Now, I've got many favourite images of Elvis in concert or from movies or from the 50s or 70s or 60s this is one of my favorites i would absolutely love to get this image here on a poster printed and framed i absolutely adore this image i'm just going to put the vinyl down and talk you through what the sticker says on the front the sticker on the front says international hotel las vegas nevada alvis August 26, 1969, 50th anniversary to LP from the 11 CD box set, Alvis Live 1969, featuring all of the August 1969 Las Vegas recordings. And again, on the back, look at that as well. Another superb image of Alvis there sitting down at the front of the stage. And uh, oh, another great image. And it's a gatefold. Look at, I mean, look at this here. Let me get closer in there for you. That's on the left. Such great images. And on the right is just again, International Hotel presents Alvis. Let me talk you through the track listing. Side A, Blue Suede Shoes, I Got a Woman, All Shook Up, Love Me Tender, Jailhouse Rock, Don't Be Cruel, Heartbreak Hotel, Hound Dog. Side B, I Can't Stop Loving You, Mystery Train Tiger Man, Monologue, Side C, Baby What You Want Me To Do, Run Away, Are You Lonesome Tonight Laughing Version, Rubbernecking, Yesterday Hey Jude, Introductions, Side D, In The Ghetto, This Is The Story, Suspicious Minds, Can't Help Falling In Love, let me share with you the vinyl inside. I'm only going to get the one vinyl out because both vinyls are exactly the same. And as you can see, it's on the orange RCA Victor label via the Legacy Edition with its orange middle there in its usual white sleeve. I mean, as I was saying, it's heavyweight vinyl. So there you go. In immaculate condition people have asked me before how do i look after the vinyls what i tend to do is you know obviously whether they're brand new or second hand i always clean them and to me that's the best policy because when you purchase a brand new vinyl you're still gonna have maybe some slight hairs on it i've purchased one recently not an Elvis vinyl I purchased an, a, a brand new vinyl recently and when I played it, the quality wasn't the best and uh, I noticed there was a few hair, a few little hairs on it so I cleaned it down It was and then it was perfect and every single time I finish playing a vinyl or an Elvis vinyl, I always get my vinyl cleaning kit, clean it right down and make sure it's kept in very good condition and the same goes for the second hand vinyl as well. Secondhand vinyl, you can get some outstanding qualities. You know, most of the vinyl that I purchase are of high quality. You do get a few secondhand ones that it looks like there's a few scuff marks on it. And uh, again, always clean them down. And, um, you know, you're going to get the odd one that when you take it home might be scratched. But touch word, which I am doing right now, I've never had that problem where I've purchased a vinyl that I've got home has been and has been scratched, thankfully. So 
always, always please keep your vinyl clean. Clean them afterwards. Use a, a proper vinyl cleaning kit that comes with a cloth and some spray and just follow the instructions and uh, i promise it will keep it in tip top condition um so yeah and also um what i just wanted to say was again a massive thank you for all of your support of my channel recently and as you all know i'm trying to grow my channel gradually and you know i've got some interest coming along um with regards to a sponsor so at this moment in time i haven't decided what i want to do with that as yet but again thank you for making my channel grow we're getting there and as a as a 100 percent pure alphas family together well you know this channel will just get bigger and better and anything i can do along the way to to make this channel better for you all please leave me a message in the comments below but yeah going back to the vinyl in itself a great vinyl from 2019 to celebrate the 50th anniversary of Alvis's August 1969 International Hotel concert. Again, do you have this in your collection? Do you have it on vinyl? Do you have it on CD? I would love to see all your comments below and I will reply to you all as soon as I possibly can. As always, Please keep Alphys close to your hearts. Please keep on playing his music. That's most important to me. And as always, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, but uh, enjoy watching my channel, please hit that subscribe button. It will help make my channel grow no end. And uh, thank you for all of your ongoing support. And as I always sign off by saying, love to you all. And I will speak soon, everybody. Bye-bye.